Hi, this is Christy Burcham with Scissortail Studio, and I'm here today with a quick video that's a special request from a friend who wants to know how to print the applique patterns for the designs she creates in the Bernina Software 7. So we're going to create a simple applique design and then show you how to print the patterns so you can pre-cut your applique pieces. We'll start in the Digitize menu and choose the applique tool. Next, we will digitize a simple shape. And just for fun, we'll add a second star by copying and pasting the first one. And we'll overlap those stars. Now let's change the color of the second star and let's remove the overlapping satin stitches. So we'll select both applique pieces and from the edit menu choose remove applique overlaps and you'll see that the satin stitches underneath the top layer of applique have been removed. Now if we were ready to stitch this design we would want to print out those applique patterns by going to file print preview and then selecting our options. From options we're going to choose how we want to view our design and we want to choose the applique patterns. So where it says worksheets you want to be sure that applique patterns is checked off. You can print the other parts of the design at the same time if you want to but for now we're just going to choose the applique patterns and click OK. Now what you're going to get is the first page is going to be your guide. So this shows us what the design looks like and you'll see there's a little number one and a little number two. So this tells you that this is your first applique piece and this is your second applique piece. Now we'll go to the next page and you'll see the actual applique patterns. So here is applique piece number one and here is applique piece number two. So if you print this out it will be at 100 percent of size so you can then place it on your fabric and cut it out ahead of time before you begin stitching. So that's how you print the applique patterns for your designs. When you're ready to stitch you'll say file, write to machine, and then choose the way you want to send your design to your machine whether it's a USB stick or a direct transfer. If you have any questions about this technique or if you have a special request you can email me at Christy C-H-R-I-S-T-Y at scissortailstudio.com or visit my blog at scissortailstudio.com. Thanks!